we are going to discuss chapter 10 demonstrative geometry that is very very important part of our maths work it's uh, we will discuss theorem 1 here and it's on page 171 in your book as well so we will start with the statement that is here if a straight line stands on another straight line then the sum of measures of two angles so formed is equal to two right angles now look very carefully at this uh, statement the first part of the sentence that is before the comma in this whole statement I have written that with blue and the next part I have written with black so this divides the statement into two parts the first part if a straight line stands on another straight line is the given of the theorem and the black one is said to be the proof and that I will discuss with you in a minute now look let's look at the given geometrical figure it is a straight line a b stands on another straight line you can see firstly a straight line a b is shown and o c o c stands on it at point o so this is the given of the ge uh, geometrical theorem once again we will read it from here AB line AB is a straight line and OC stands on it at point O you can see here now in order to prove once again we will go back to the statement the sum of measures of the two angles so formed is equal to two right angles now you know that right angle each right angle is of 90 degrees so the sum of it will become 180 degree so see how we will write the proof to prove measure angle AOC plus measure angle BOC is equal to 180 degree once again we will do the proof measurement angle AOC plus measurement angle BOC is equal to 180 degree and I have told you that as each right angle is of 90 degree so 90 and 90 the sum of it is 180 now as we have written this to prove we need to have some statement and reasons so as we have here measurement angle AOC plus measurement angle BOC is equal to 180 degree that is angle AOB so this is angle addition postulate as first reason for the theorem next is measurement angle AOB that is equal to 180 degree that you can see here and it is a straight angle this is the second reason to understand the theorem Therefore, measurement angle AOC plus measurement angle BOC is equal to 180 degree and this is proved by equation 1 and equation number 2. So, this is how you will discuss uh, or understand theorem 1.